Hello everybody. Happy Sunday afternoon. This is Lindy Tate from Tater Buggin. Hello if you're watching the replay, be sure and hit hashtag replay to let me know you were here. Gonna wait for my friends to get here and I'm going to use this time to get going down here. Hello Betty. Betty's here. How are you? Hi Becky. And if you're watching on replay, you can fast forward through me saying hello to all my friends because you know how that goes. Okay. Hello, Patricia. Happy Sunday to you, too. Thank you, Patty, for sprinkling. I appreciate that. Um, let me get down here. I want to see your comments better. Now, there's Mary Alice and Mary Jane and Deborah. How are y'all doing today? It is a gorgeous day here. It's Ring. I'm so happy. I love this time of year. It's my favorite. Are y'all ready to, to make something today? As usual, I um I have a, a bucket of ideas and it takes me to the last minute to decide exactly what I want to do today and get all this stuff. Hey Carol and Jody and Heaven's here. Hey Heaven, Denise is back from the UK. Thanks for tossing the tater, Betty. Hey, Amy. There's Charlotte. Oh, yeah. Sick. Yeah, we're, I don't know. It's it's nice and warm here today. Hey, Luann. I didn't know if Luann would be here today because she's here in Memphis and it's gorgeous. Hey, Terry. Terry, I've got a bag for you right down there, girl. When you coming to get it? <laughs> got your order ready. Hello, Kay. And Judy is here, Bobby and Nicole. Um, so there's Deb. It keeps telling me down here that my video's interrupted. I hope it's hope it's not getting squirrely on us. How's everybody? We, we oh y'all are coming on in. I have the door wide open. I told y'all I was gonna open that door. Terry, 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 did you hear? That's your package down there. I've got your order. Y'all excuse the construction. There's been construction here all day. A crew just now left from fixing our kitchen ceiling and putting the roof on the uh, shed out there. So it's been a crazy day. Hey, Mary. Um, Terry, give me a shout out if you saw that. That's your order. You ready? Are you, tell me when you want to pick it up. <laughs> he came to the window like, yeah. Hey, Kat. Oh, good, Luann. Now, that's smart. Hey, Stephanie. Have y'all seen these at the Dollar Tree now? Um. Oh, and by the way, I've got my Tater Buggin' t-shirt on. It's in the, um, it's in our online shop. It is so comfortable. It's the softest shirt. Perfect, Terry. Thanks. I just want to make sure you knew. I was going to message you anyway later today. I was... Let me tell y'all, this place was a disaster. I mean, a disaster. Hey, Cindy. And so yesterday I took the day. Oh, thank you, Terry. Hey, Tanya. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, There's a little pollen, but that's okay. I don't even care. Hey, Norma. So I've got before and after pictures. It's bad. I mean, I gutted well, I didn't get it because there's still a lot to do, but I took a lot down and out and in the floor, reorganized my little rolling cart down here beside me is so organized. I cannot even believe. Hey, Ann and Rhonda. Um, so anyway, I toted big tubs. Uh, Mr. Tater Buggin was out of town yesterday. So thank you, Judy, for the stars. I appreciate it. Those are, that is so sweet of you. Hey, Mary, thanks for spreading the love, Mary. Um, oh, good, Charlotte, maybe this will inspire you. Uh, so anyway, all day long, picking up those huge totes and taking them out to the storage building and moving stuff around. I can barely move today. I didn't realize how out of shape I truly am. Thank you, Luann, that's so sweet. Thank you for the stars. Um, so I had to take in a leave. Ugh. I crawled out of bed this morning. I, oh, I felt like I've been in my truck. Hey, Donna. 
Happy Sunday to you. So we're going to just get started. I did, hey Debbie, I did a little bit of, just a little bit of prep work so you wouldn't have to watch me stain stuff. Thanks for spreading the love. I know, <laughs> that's usually how it is, Ann. Uh, yeah. Oh man, but if y'all had seen it, you know, I had my big canvas here that I was working on. I could, this big old room and I couldn't even move around and it was making me crazy. I can take clutter for a while. I think we all can as crafters because we have to put up with it. Hey, Melanie, how are you doing? And there's Gail here. How are you doing, Gail? I love your face. Um, maybe so, Karen. I think it's uh, a little bit out of shape too. I need to pick up those weights again. Uh, I'm gonna pull this off while we're chatting. But any, wow, that's easy. <laughs> that was easy to do. But I think what I'm gonna do is hit it with the heat gun and, and get the rest of this off. Even though I'm gonna have, kind of put something in the middle. If I if I sniff, y'all, I'm sorry. It is pollen allergies. So it is like a different place. Still a lot to do. Still a lot more organization to do. My but my whole cabinet, my big cabinet's organized now. Oh, I just love it so much. It feels so much better. So, that's what I did yesterday. Hey, Diana. Hey, Danette. There's Danette from Double Time Growing uh, with Danette. Y'all gotta check out her page if you don't already follow her. I'm so glad, Melanie. I'm glad to hear it's getting better. Let me see. Okay. Let me try, where did it go, where did it go? <laughs> I'm scared. Let me use this. I just wanna get this um, right off the front because I wanna hit it with a little bit of chalk paint. It it didn't look terribly plasticky, but I think I like the chalk paint look. Hey, Sherry. Hey, Janet. It is the most perfect, gorgeous, wonderful, awesome day today, and it's spring. We made it through another winter, y'all. I am so happy. This is my favorite time of year. Oh, Mary, um, I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, have you ever, well, Terry, it, it took me I think it was a lot, I think it was not longer than nine hours. I'm not sure. Hey, Michelle, I am going to make a pretty little um, spring decor piece with this today. So, let's see. Um, it's, you know, it's plastic, but it's pretty. And um, it comes in gray and brown. I actually, I think I have one of the brown ones. Why do you say that, Gail? You, just because you like it so much? No, it is spring here, and it feels good. Although there was frost on the roof this morning. But it it's nice out there now. Gail is a winter girl. I'm, I'm not. But that's okay. She's my big sis. Let's see how this uh, chalk paint's gonna look on it. I just wanted to give it, okay, so when you paint it, you can see the texture on it. So I'm thinking I may actually distress it a little bit and that'd be fun. Oh, isn't it wonderful, Judy? Oh, I love it. And everything's blooming and looks so pretty and making me sniff and sneeze. Um, you know, Lorreen, I'm surprised at how, um, oh, it itches too. These, how easy these have been to find once they came in. Um, I've seen them in all the colors. Now, y'all, I'm sorry. If y'all, um, are on our Tater Bug and Sweet Tater Bugs page, we have a run in, um, what am I trying to say? Post that uh, where you can post if you have trouble finding some pieces, and we can, you know, there are people who are willing to look at their Dollar Trees and um, 
send it to you. So you, if there's things in particular you're, you're looking for, you can post there and let everybody know. Melanie, where's your mama? Where is my moderator? Where's Opa? Is Opa here? Hey, Elizabeth. You did make it. What are you doing on this beautiful day? I am just painting this little window with a little chalk paint. <laughs> he keeps coming by after he saws and makes a face like, sorry. He's not quitting sawing though, is he, y'all? Okay, so I just want to hit this with a little bit. Oh, uh, Luann, this one, I've seen them at, at all of our Dollar Trees, but I got this one at Witten. That's where it was, Witten Road. Still, it's still really good. Um, I also hit Highway 70 today, and um, they, they, they're so-so. That wit somebody went in on that Witten Road store and said, "Y'all get your act together," and they did it because they've got they've got a lot of stuff now. Um, this was one of those things I could have done ahead of time too, but I wanted y'all to see what it looks like in the store first, and that didn't take too long. Oh, you lucky thing! I want I want to come swim in your pool. Hey, girl. Hey, Penny P. Hello, Joy. I'm gonna hit this with the uh, little bit of the heat gun real quick. And then see if, what it looks like, mm, what it looks like distressed. The bug. It's been a, it's, I'm a little, a little out of sorts. It's, it's been a crazy day. Like I said, we had a crew here that fixed our ceiling where we had, had a leak. Um, I'm sorry, I just got a text. My really good friend's mom is in the hospital, and that was about her. Um, we got a, where we had had a leak, we got the ceiling fixed, and they put the roof on the shed. <laughs> I wish I could, Penny. That'd be a road trip. Marines in Chicago, and it's beautiful there today, too. Okay, I love it. All right. Um, how should I hope? How do I want to distress this? I think maybe just a little bit of the Waverly Wax. What do y'all think? Do you, Terry? I'm so glad. We've got, you know, we've got our Tater Buggins. We've got our Sweet Taters t-shirts. And then um, somebody wanted me to put out our my logo t-shirt, which my son also designed my logo. Um, is it just Donna or is everybody having trouble? Uh-oh. <laughs> Do you try? Sometimes it helps to go out and come back in, but if it's a lot of you, I wonder if I have a bad connection today. Hope not. Um. I don't know what's going on. Let's see, y'all. So, if I just distress it a little bit, a little jumpy, I hope, mm, I hope it's not too bad, y'all. I know how frustrating that can be. Okay. I might should have just left it alone. It comes and goes. Right now it's good. Yours is fine. Okay, so what do y'all, before I do any more of this, I want y'all's opinion. So do I make it rust, mm -mm, rustic or leave it white? Thank you, Holly, for the stars. I appreciate that. It's so sweet. You like the distressing? Okay, okay. All right. I just, yeah, I get, get, do get distracted when I see y'all are having trouble because I know how frustrating that is um, when you're trying to watch somebody make something and it's freezing up on you. Okay, I'm not gonna do too much of this, but this will kind of make it match our window box, I think. 
course, you know, you can, you can make your window look however you want to. I'll show, let me show you, Jody. I am about to add a little window box to it that's uh, stained. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that, Ann. Let's see. Let me get this wet wipe out, and we'll just move it around a little bit on here. That's a great idea. Thank you, Diana. You're so sweet. Yeah, Judy. I think that's the way to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little here and there, like it seemed, oh, much better. Y'all are brilliant. Yes, look how this is looking. See, it just gives it a little bit. Yeah. Th Elizabeth, you're so sweet. <laughs> Terry, thank you. Y'all are just, that's so kind of you. I appreciate that. Okay. Elizabeth, have you been to... Have you been to the Dollar Tree lately? She lives right around the corner from that wonderful Dollar Tree. I haven't been in a couple of weeks over there. Okay, how about that, y'all? I'm backwards, so. I think so too, Betty. That's why I love crafting with y'all. When I'm sitting here crafting by myself, I, I wish I was here with y'all where you could, um, tell me what to do. I got it at Dollar Tree, Cheryl. They have them in uh, gray and brown and white. There may, is there a black one? I don't, I don't know that there's a black one, but anyway, you can paint them up whatever color you want. Now, this is a little Dollar Tree tray, and I just went ahead and stained it, um, so y'all wouldn't have to sit through all of that. Thank you, Marie. Thanks, Patricia. Okay, and y'all can see, look at this, how perfectly it fits down in here. But that's not, we're not ready for that yet. But I just wanted to show you how, how perfect that is for a window box. Isn't that pretty? So what I'm going to do next is, I'm going to try something. This um, scrapbook paper came out of a book that I got, found it actually at Walmart. And the whole book was like $5.00. So what I thought I would do is, since it has those birds on it, I'm going to put this on the back of my window. Just springy, you know, pretty, pretty. You like it, Jody? where I'm going with this one? Okay. So let me, uh, I want to get it positioned where you can see those two birds right there. All right, where's my pencil? but there it is okay I did I cleaned up yesterday so yeah gotta look for stuff thank you Melanie oh good Charlotte you've got the little box too you're all set you are all set okay let me cut this out um okay finished painting the five little fat birds Oh, great. Oh, I'm so glad that was Lisa. Okay, thanks for letting me know. You think so? I hope so. I thought this was just, you know, pretty. And I really believe that um, you could put any kind of paper in the back. You don't even have to put paper if you don't want to. But I just thought it would be fun when I saw that this paper had the birds on it and it's a pretty yellow polka dot. I just thought that would look cute peeking out on the other side of the window. Make it extra springy. I got some more stuff to make. Hello, Grace and Darlene and Charlene. Everybody's coming on in. Um, I got the stuff to make some more of the little birdhouses that we did where we added the spackle to make it look like um, raw wood so they went over well in the booth yesterday so I thought I better make some more hey Tanya hello Lori I am doing so great Tanya this spring is here and it's wonderful and I love it <laughs> so okay we're gonna let me hold it up so y'all can see how it's gonna look so I lined it up where 
You can see the two birds. Let me see, I wanna fix it. It goes over this way just a smidge, I think. See how that, it, there we go. What do you think? Isn't that pretty? Oh, Tony, it's okay. We really haven't done much. I just got this window prepped, so it's just fine. Now let's see, I'm going to just hit it with some hot glue. Really springy, right? Now there's a hanger right here, so I don't wanna go over that. Okay, and I'm just going to try to lay, ooh, lay this down. Stand up a little bit so I get it in the right spot. Well, okay, let me fix that. <laughs> it's not exactly right. Because, goodness, that that uh, glue dries really fast. Let me try that again, y'all. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Donna, for the stars. That's so sweet of you. Y'all are so kind. You can remove the three screws from the back and have two frames to craft with. Oh, you sure can. That's a great tip. Thank you. Thank you, Mary. We've got these in our online shop now. So, it, and it, I will, I can attest to the fact that it is so, so soft. It's really soft. Okay, I, this, this was a major fail, y'all. I'm just going to do it a little bit at a time here. Okay. Try that again. Now that's better. You can do it. Um, Teresa, I found it at the Dollar Tree. They got them in um, uh, gray and brown and white for sure. And a, there may have been a black one. I'm not sure. And it has a little sign in the middle, but you can just pull that right off. Mary, our online shop is taterbuggin.myshopify.com. And this is in the apparel section. I'm not used to being so organized. Everything's right back in its place. And, uh, okay, now, there we go. We're all adhered now. Thank you for the hearts. Y'all are sweet. Okay, now let's, this is my little tray that we stained. I stained it ahead of time and I don't want, you know, we're going for a window box look, not a tray look. So, um, we are going to, I just picked out this. I think I got this at Hobby Lobby, actually. You know, just kind of a nice little pretty ribbon. So, we're going to um, cover up. We're going to cover up. But see how it's just wide enough to cover those holes? So, we're going to do that. Just cut this and we'll glue this on. So it'll be a little border. Yeah, they're in with the picture frames. One day construction will be over here, y'all. <laughs> One day. Oh, I hate to hear that, Ann. Uh, Y'all, is it still acting ugly for all of you? I wonder if it's a Facebook thing or if it's my internet or what. That's blurry. Really, Tanya? Um, they still had... Yeah, I found a whole bunch of them last week on Witten Road, and they still had them today there. 
they had, I'm not gonna say they had a bunch of them, but they had probably at least five. Hi, Jan. Hey, Susan. Oh, so it's not me, Becky. Oh. Oh, no. There's, I don't like technical issues getting in the way of us having our Sunday fun day. I'm just going to keep crafting away. Y'all hang in there with me if you can. Oh, good. Holly's not having issues. All right. Yeah, this just gives it a nice little hello, Jojo. I love that name. Um, gives it a nice little... Um, what am I trying to say? Design element, maybe? That's kind of pretty. I like it all right. Oh, is it Jan? Oh, I can't wait to see that. Oh, I bet it's so beautiful. I didn't get one made. It's hard to, to take time to make something for yourself. <laughs> Okay, so there we go. We have covered up our little um, our little tray. Now, let's, let me just see. You can, let me just tell you, you can just sit this all the way down in here like this, but I'm, I want mine to be elevated a little bit because of those birds on there. I really want to be able to see those birds, so. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to use some Gorilla Glue on one side, and I'm going to do a hot glue on the other side, and maybe that'll really give it a, a firm hold. If I can get this open. Uh-oh. Hey, Labriska. I'm so glad you're here. Labriska from My Eclectic Treasures is here, y'all. I know you know her. But if you don't, you should. You got to go over and follow her page. How are you doing this? Isn't it beautiful in Tennessee today, Labriska? Ugh. She, I'm on, I'm in West Tennessee, and she's in Middle Tennessee. <laughs> Careful with that Gorilla Glue. <laughs> yeah, I, I could put the Jenga blocks underneath, but I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. Um, and, it, you know, that's definitely something you can do. Hi, Jill. All right. Get some hot glue going here. And now let's just hold it right there for a minute. <laughs> you use your teeth. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to see it, Labriska. I know it's going to be gorgeous. Ah, oh, going to be gorgeous. Okay, so here's what I'm doing. Where am I? Here's where we are, y'all. Now, are you going to just stay right there? Now, got some little grapevine wreaths. Yeah, Charlene, apparently it's a Facebook thing. They said it's not just me. We can put a little, um, you've got a, let me hold it up closer. Where you pull off that middle piece leaves a little, hmm, it's not bad, but you see what I'm, I'm saying. It's got a little place right there. So, well, that's, yeah, you can hang it right here. I'm thinking about just, it's from Dollar Tree, Labriska. <laughs> came just like this. I just hit it with a little um, chalk paint and antique wax. They've got a little sign in the middle. I've got another one in the cabinet, um, but it was brown. So, I think what I'm going to do is... 
I'm gonna fill this first. I cut some Dollar Tree foam to fit right down in here. Now this is why I didn't do the jingle logs, y'all. Because this foam is going right down in here. So we can, yes, way, I know, aren't they great? I can just see a million different things you can do with it. I put the scrapbook paper on the back. That 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 was um, in a book that I got at Walmart that was like $5. It's a whole big, thick scrapbook paper spring extravaganza book. <laughs> yeah, that's what I think I'll do. And the paper was from a book from Walmart. Um, and I love every page. It's so pretty. I've been using it and using it. Okay, so now let's start filling it with pretties. Um, I've got my little box of little spare stuff over here. Let's see what all we've got. We want to go tall in the back, right? And because y'all know I am not a, um, I don't. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna glue this. Should I glue this in or leave it alone? What do y'all think? Glue the the um, styrofoam in there to make it hold better. This is why I love crafting with y'all because you, you tell me the best way to do things. Wasn't it, Teresa? I about dropped my teeth when I saw that it was only $5. I couldn't buy it fast enough. Thrill, fill, spill. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I don't know that I have any spillage, but I'll I'll work on it. I'll see. that. I thought I would go kind of tall in the back here. I think I've got another piece of this. You would glue it, Carol? No glue, Cindy says. <laughs> Let me see how it starts to go as I start to stick stuff in it. Yeah, see, that's kind of what I was thinking, Charlotte. That way you could just change it out. Um, Becky, it was in the craft section at my Walmart. Sorry. Very sorry. Very, very sorry, y'all. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm, uh, let's see here. This is the hardest part for me, y'all. I didn't need it either, Stephanie, but you know what? I sure have been using it. And, I mean... I pulled it out today when I decided to do this, this particular craft, and um, saw that it had this, the pretty yellow polka dots and they had birds in the corner. I thought, well, wouldn't that be perfect in the background, you know, of the window? You see the birds out there. All right, this could, uh, I gotta, I gotta do, let's see. Let me get in my bag of tricks here. And there's something, oh, you know what, y'all? I've been hoarding these. This was the only one I ever found at my uh, Dollar Tree. I wish I could have gotten them in every color. I'm so sorry, Ann, I know. And I understand if, you, if it's too annoying and you've got to go. See, if I had like three of these i would just fill this whole thing with these bright yellow flowers but we're just gonna have to sprinkle them in with other things all right let's go with how about some of this i got this at uh, michael's the other day on sale so we're just gonna start tucking stuff in Y'all might have to help me with this part because I'm not very good at flower arranging. <laughs> My bag of tricks. I know they look like they're, and they're a different kind of uh, floral. They're a really thick, um, beautiful 
plastic. It's hard, it's harder. It's not, you know, like silk, but they look, they look more real to me than some of the others we see. Oh yeah, this will get this will be good filler, I think. I'm gonna leave that little stem on there so I can poke it down in there. Oh, Betty, feel better. I'm so sorry. I hope you feel better soon. I think so too, Judy. And I've had them since. Oh, might have been before Valentine's Day. And I just looked out and I saw them one day. I've never seen them again. Not at any of my Dollar Trees. Not even the one in Germantown. And um, so I've just been hanging on to them for just the right project. And this may be it. I don't know. This is where everything can go south fast with me. I see other people do their um, little flower boxes and all, and it just seems so easy and effortless and boom, 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 and it's all full and done. It never goes that way with me. Oh, that's, isn't that fun, Sue? I get so excited. Hey, Kim. Welcome, welcome, I'm glad you're here. We're just filling a window box and it may take me uh, forever. Oh, my monthly classes. Thank you, Melanie. Yeah, in fact, we're coming up on a new month and I've been trying to decide what our um, what next month's class is gonna be. We, uh, I offer cl monthly classes. They're a different theme every month and um, you sign up for the ones that you want to sign up for. They're in my online shop, $10. And you have unlimited access forever. Thank you, Norma, I'm so glad you, hey, Marjorie. Um, so yeah, um, we are finishing up a floral. And so one day this week, uh, we're gonna have our bonus craft video um, for that class, I always try to, I try to come up with an extra craft that kind of fits the theme for the month. So, um, so we just try to have a good time and what else am I forgetting? Yeah, I, we, we have, you can still go back and sign up for any of the ones we've had. Like I say, they go on forever. There was a gnome, a snowman family, um, a cow. We have our January was our hand lettering class. It is still going strong. Okay, so I'm, I'm going down the sides. I know that's wrong. I know that's wrong, but I was just kind of seeing how, to, how I was going to do this. Let me start filling some in the middle. I'm so glad y'all are enjoying the classes. I sure have fun with them. Y'all make them a lot of fun. And it ends up, you end up having a really great community of friends. You know, everybody talks to each other and shows their progress and their, what they've done. And you don't think so, Elizabeth? I think there are kind of rules to, to flower arranging and I, I wanna I wanna do it so bad, so I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna keep practicing so that maybe one day I'll be good at it. But at least, you know, y'all can see where I'm going with it. And um, what let's I wanna see how once we have some stuff in it, I'm backwards, so that makes it difficult. Yeah. I even thought about putting one of our little fuzzy birds in the middle of the wreath, but I don't know. When I found the paper um, that had the birds on it, I thought, well, I don't know that I want to compete with uh, those birds. We got to get some flowers in here now, y'all. All right, let's see. Uh, let's pull some of these. 
everybody's sawing today. Everybody's sawing today. Because Wendy's on live. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Elizabeth. You're so encouraging. I'm gonna fill in at the um, at the base with some Spanish moss or moss, you know. Oh, I love hearing that, Elizabeth. You're sweet. She has Elizabeth is gonna be famous, y'all. She is uh, on a roll. I'm telling you. That girl took off with her painting. A lot of y'all have. M Melanie says, what's new in my shop? Well, this t-shirt's new, but um, what else is new? We've got new mushrooms. Um, what did I add this week? What all did I add? Somebody help me out. I'm so busy trying to figure out flowers, I can't think. <laughs> hey, Cindy. How's everything in Texas today? I'm just trying to arrange flowers. Well, it finally let you back in. Did they, they weren't letting you in here? Okay, I'm gonna start. Here I go, I'm cutting these roses, y'all. I'm gonna start putting a few little roses in. That's too long. That's too tall. Hold on. Do you, Melanie? The large painting is finished. It's in the other room now, just waiting for her to come pick it up. She was happy with it. Um, oh, it was just spinning. Ugh. It's something with Facebook today, and I just hate it. Everybody's having trouble. Uh, oh, and y'all, <gasps> the puzzles will be here tomorrow, according to tracking. The puzzles will be here tomorrow. So if you've ordered your micro puzzles, they start going out Tuesday. I should, shouldn't I? That would be really fun to um, put a tater bug car in in the um, in the online shop so everybody could decorate up their own tater bug. <laughs> uh, let's see. That's a really good idea. Why have I not thought of that, y'all? Uh, Judy, I'll go get it if you, or I'll get Mr. Taterbug to run in the other room and get it. Um, I'm telling you, that gave me a run for my money, y'all. It was, I think it is, well, I know it's five feet one way, and um, I can't remember. So, I mean, it's it's huge. It wouldn't even fit on a on an easel. So I had to set up two ottomans, my wicker ottomans, behind me to put it on. And she seems really, really happy with it. I hope she'll enjoy it. It was definitely, you know, it was a challenge. But it's done. And I, uh, I did a whole layer. The first layer was just, um, was just texture. And then the second layer, I actually painted the church, the tree line, what else, with texture. So it lifts further off the canvas. Um, well, I'll just have to show y'all, Rita. If, if y I should have left it in here, I guess. I wasn't thinking, I just moved it out. I had to move it out yesterday to, to reorganize the studio and uh, it's in the guest room, so. All right, I'm gonna sprinkle a few more of these in here. What's this? Let's see, where'd you come from? There's a little different color greenery. Let's see if it'll poke down in there. Okay, it's, well, it's getting fuller. 
It's getting fuller. It's coming along. What do y'all think? Uh, no, Shirley. Actually, this was from the Dollar Tree. The arch frame is from the Dollar Tree. How about that? Hey, babe. I don't know if he can hear me. Oh, no, he just went next door. I wasn't going to get him to go get the, the painting. I'll get him to do it when he gets back. I know, Charlene. I was just thinking that. I might, I might end up going lower with everything um, so that we can see the birds. Because that was kind of the point, right? Yeah, I may go lower with, with um, some flowers. That's what I've got out here. Let's see, okay, we could, what else have I got? This purple goes good with yellow, doesn't it? How about some of these? Maybe just a few of these down low. We'll see how it looks. Oh, y'all like the colors, good. I'm just gonna fill in some of this. I'm sure there would be easier foam to work with. I would suggest that kind of foam that you can actually, you know, stick your finger right in. You can get it at Dollar Tree too. What I'm gonna end up doing, you could, Charlene, I put it right at the top, um, right at the top of the box though. Here's what we're making, Cindy. We're making a pretty little spring window box. I'm gonna hang a, a little, it's hard when you're backwards. <laughs> Makes you look like you're a little drunk. There we go, yeah, something like that. And we'll just spring it all up and um, I'm gonna cover up the foam, of course, down in there after I get a few more flowers in it. I like purple and yellow too. I didn't, Grace, I just glued it. I just glued it right there on the back with some Gorilla Glue and some hot glue. And, um, but now if y'all do this, I'll tell you that um, you can do your all of your floral really low and the, the whole window will sit right down in that box perfectly. Hey, Deanna, how are you doing today? Oh, I'm liking the little purple flowers in there with it. Yeah. And we're gonna, I'm gonna go back in and lower. I think, I think I want all the, you know, I want them to be, where is it? I see it in the, this guy right here is too tall. He's either got to be pushed over here to dangle. Um, here he comes back. I may ask him to to bring me the to bring y'all the um, the canvas. Hey, babe. Can't hear me. Hey, Gerald. Come here. Sorry, y'all. And this guy has got to go. Would you do me a huge favor? They would like to see the big canvas. Would you mind getting that for me? What? <laughs> oh, of course I wouldn't mind getting that for you. <laughs> Thank you. I know, Anne, I'm losing the birds. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back in and I'm gonna make my roses shorter. Y'all will see it in the... um when I, you know, I'll post a picture of it, but I'm gonna, I'll mess with it this afternoon and I'm gonna lower my flowers so that the birds can show. 
I will work with it. Hey, Cindy. Um, so we get so we can see our birds. But I'm gonna fix it. I promise. But this gives y'all the idea, and I'm gonna um, I'll put our little wreath on there. And take a picture for you. Amy, I just poked a hole through this canvas. I would have to kill him. <laughs> I would die. I would die. Let me get up so you can see this big old canvas. Okay, I'm going to start from here. And work. Am I going the right way? Uh-huh. You see how long it is, y'all? <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Let me measure it for you. It's four feet by five feet. Four feet by five feet? Yep. You remember, that's it exactly? I think that's it. And it's 60 inches, 48 by 60 I think so. 60. Five feet. I know, that's four feet. And that's four feet? Okay, <coughs> so it's four feet by five feet. So that's so it. They get, to, Let me... they get to see all of it? Move, yeah. Move. Oh, sorry. Here we go. And I think if you tilt it a little bit, <laughs> you turn it a little bit, you might be able to see that it's uh, textured. Lots and lots of texture on it. I'm glad y'all like it. Uh, I hope she'll be pleased with it. She's got a a big old wall for it. Um, the scrap That is scrapbook paper. On the back here, um, it's a book that I found at Walmart for $5.00. And so, um, you got to get some of that, that's, that scrapbook paper book. And you know, I don't think I've ever bought a whole book of scrapbook paper before, but that they're all so pretty that I had to have it. And I've used it a couple of times already. I used it on, well, it's at the booth now when I, you know, I took the first window twig window I made and, um, put it on a frame and I had some of this scrapbook, not this particular scrapbook paper, but out of that book in the background, it was just pretty springy paper. So anyway, this is what we did today. I have, I think I have all of this week's live crafts lined up and I can't wait to do them. I'm excited about them because spring is here. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to do all things spring. Ah. So, y'all, thank you for hanging in with me on the blurry craziness that Facebook was today. And enjoy the rest of your day. Um, I know Amanda Maid has a, a live sale at 4 today. So, that gives you an hour before that starts up. And I, appreciate, I always appreciate y'all hanging out with me. And uh, I just hope you enjoy the rest of your Sunday. One more saw. I uh, love you all, and I'll see you Tuesday at 4 o'clock. I hope, I hope it won't be, Ann. Thank you for being here. I, and thank you all for the stars. That was so sweet of you. It was just a lot of fun. I had a fun. I'm going to fix this up where you can see the birds, and I'll post it. Thank you, Stephanie. That's so sweet. That is so sweet. Y'all just make my day. Okay, good, Charlotte, because you've got the pieces for this. So just, I can't wait to see yours. And listen, if y'all do this or something like it, post it to Taterbug and Sweet Taterbugs. I want to see it. Puzzles tomorrow. Have y'all ordered your puzzles? I'm excited about those puzzles. So you'll see a post about those um, tomorrow too, I'm sure. All right, love y'all. Have a great rest of the day. See you Tuesday. Bye.